Ultrasounding versus palpating. We can do it a week earlier. We can start at 28 days, ultrasound, get a heart, fetal heartbeat and everything at that time versus the earliest we would ever palpate is usually 35 days. Um, we will catch more twins, check ovaries, look for multiple CLs. We find multiple CLs, we look for multiple calves. So we do find more twins, ultrasounding versus palpating. Um, fetal sexing, anywhere from 55 to 60 days, starting there on up to whenever we cannot see the calf anymore. So usually we're pretty safe up to 80, 85 days. Sometimes you can see them up to four months, sometimes, but it's not dependable. So usually the sexing window is, I like to say, between like 60 and 80 days. Um, there's, when we fetal sex, we look for little swellings that develop into the, either the penis or the clitoris. So on a bull calf or a bull fetus, the swelling will be down right behind the, where the umbilical cord goes in. Um, when I find pregnancies here, um, I'll show you that. Um, the female, it'll be right underneath her tail, right back by the rear end. Um, so we find a heartbeat, um, go back, I mean this is at 60 days, 60 to 80 days, um, we can do sex determination. When you get up past four months, there really isn't a whole lot of benefit to ultrasounding over palpating because we end up, if we're aging, we end up a lot of times doing the same things to get an age. Um, whether it's grabbing a piece of the calf or leg ahead or um, uterine arteries, do it measuring them with our fingers and trying to figure out the size there to correlate to an age. Um, so basically the first trimester we can really benefit from ultrasounding beyond that. Um, calves are too big, they're over the pelvis, sometimes you won't even get to them. Um, so then you end up doing the same things we do with the pelvis. And then sometimes when I go out, I'll prefer to use the ultrasound even for those later six, seven month pregnancies because I can reach in, bam, I see fluid, I see buttons. Sometimes just for speed, I prefer it. Um, but yeah, $30 an hour, and as far as earlier pregnancies, I'm faster with the ultrasound, so it probably is about the same price per head.